playing with the bit booster and the micro bit and the HCSR04 um, sonic distance sensor, ultrasonic distance sensor. I was able to finally get it to work. Um, the problem with it is that it needs more than three volts that the um, that the gro groove ports do, and that the micro bit itself can do. Now the bit booster is powered by 4.5 volts, so any of the battery output parts. See on here where it says BATT on the ground. Any of those should be 4.5. I tried it on a couple and it, it, well, I wasn't doing something right, but I did now get it to work. Um, apparently though, I don't have any uh, single female to female jumpers, which uh, I needed. So here's what I've done. I've taken the one servo port, uh, has ground battery and P13, and used that for ground battery and trigger signal. And then I came over here to the other servo port that's got ground battery and P14 and use P14 as the echo. Um, so you see them four things wired in there with lots of extra cables because I don't have any individual female to female cables. So, and then just a simple code, um, uh, LED enabled true, connect the ultrasonic on P13, 14, the reason I want the LED enabled is because I'm just having it show me the number. Just a simple code to show me that you're working. Now, when I tr I want to try something else, but I have to disable the LED because I want to try pins uh, 3, 4, which are part of the LED, so I'll have to disable that. So i got to figure out some other way to have it show me that it's actually getting numbers. That will be a more complicated code. Um, so there it's working. Now I don't find it greatly accurate. Um, there we go. Uh, I am 30 centimeters away from a TV. And it is having trouble. Uh, so I am at about 10 centimeters. It was actually much better before. <laughs> I don't know what's happening with our connections here. So there's 11, and I'm really at about 12 or 13. Let me back out to about uh, 17. And it says 15. Let me go in. I am not at seven. I'm more at like eight or nine. I mean, it's not bad. I'm at about 25, and it's telling me 21. So when you use uh, the ultrasonic, you're going to have to allow for that. I'm now at 30, and it says 62. <laughs> um, it is all sorts of, and why it's reading zero, that's not good because that says it's not working. So I wonder if it's only getting 4.5 and it really needs 5 volts. Because it says that it's a 5 volt thing. Um, so that could be an issue of the, of the accuracy. Uh, actually getting it 5 volts that it needs. Well, what's it reading? I'm at 30 and it's reading 24. So whether it's the device is imprecise. I didn't move it. It went to 27. Also, my TV I'm aiming at has angles and um, edges that it could be. Yeah, that one wasn't pretty good. So, so it does work. Uh, precision is a problem. And we'll have to look at whether we can actually get 5 volts to it would be another thing. So, future stuff.